Hello my friends, it's April the 1st, 2015. Yes, you're looking at a dot dash dot dash chemtrail plane in the distance. It's a long way off. You're also able to see electromagnetic frequency patterns stimulating the aerosols that have been deployed in the contrails induced contrails chemically induced wow nice little uh, sulfur cloud there perhaps only suggesting sulfur because of course that's yellow and it's not just the sun is it not when it's next to that fresh uh, supposed contrail yes the sun is around going down and so are the electromagnetic frequencies creating the gravity waves and interestingly in different directions look they're dissecting each other there artificial stimulation of our environment we do not consent to this mass deception our scientists working at the UK Met Office and various different institutions around the world have to know about this climate engineering or this geo-weaponeering this is part of the military industrial complex and all the major shareholders whether it be of the top banks or hedge funds or airlines or corporations whether it's Monsanto, DuPont or whatever they're all together in the same club they're all members of uh, the Trilateral Commission or the Bilderberg Group or different groups like this, the Council on Foreign Relations, and they are in interested in creating their long-term goal, which is one world government. And they will use this covert climate engineering to create the scarcity of resources, the impression of scarcity of resources, not the reality that they will mess around with the hydrological cycles water supply and they will create droughts, floods and storms using the weather and climate modification techniques developed over at least 70 years and blame that on climate change, on global warming, which is all a lie. They have been actively developing the systems to deliberately melt the Arctic. They talked about that up until the mid 60s, quite openly with the National Science Foundation and other so-called respected institutions we're all being lied to my friends the climate change thing is a scam there is no global warming but they can make it feel hotter they can do depleted ozone strategic depleted ozone and they can do all kinds of other scientific techniques to create problems and give us the impression that we have a runaway dire global warming meltdown nonsense but it's not true, my friends. We're all being lied to. It's part of a mass deception. The elites want to create all the, the, uh, the necessary criteria to con us all into believing we must accept sustainable development, Agenda 21, the United Nations post-2015 agenda, accept the bioeconomy, accept smart meters, accept all these modern refinements for this carbon zero society they want to create which is just a con to change us all and bring us closer to this one world government using technology and their scientific dictatorship the infrastructure which is being put in place rapidly now we all need to wake up my friends this is absolutely real the global warming threat is a bogus one as talked about by the club of rome when they were seeking to find an issue to unite us all, they came up with the idea that the threat of global warming, the idea of pollution and the uh, scarcity of resources would fit the bill. Whether it's real or not, it doesn't matter. They just wanted to find the reason to create a global threat, to get globalization, to get one world government, to slave the world. This is what it's all about, my friends. It's all a massive con by those that control the military industrial complex that through the, uh, the um, deregulation of all the airlines, 
banksters were able to take over all the airlines, they bankrupted the airlines, they've taken over them, they've taken over everything. You know, it's, uh, there's, there's only two banks in the world, the rest of them are subsidiaries. It's all a massive con. Governments are just there to con us, to manage us for the elites, for the criminal, insane elites. It's time to wake up, my friends, because we have the power to stop them. We have the power to unite. We have the power to wake up the military, the police, even though there's Freemasonry and everything else controlling them, we still have the power to reach them with common sense and verifiable facts. So please do all you can, my friends, do your research and to alert as many people as possible. Overcoming all our differences, celebrating our differences. We're all people together on the third rock from the sun. All human beings together on this planet forget the divide and rule thing. That's what they use to control us, set us against each other. All this Muslims against Christians and uh, Jews against this, whatever, are all being used, including the Jews as well. These Khazars are not real Jews. They've created indoctrination for you guys too. The Zionists, you know, you're all being, you're all being enslaved as well. Israel's going to be the, one of the first cashless societies, 